Okay, good. Spread out. Okay, what? Now the idea behind this is that the arms are really like part of the movement. Yeah? So you just do that the arms go so swing the arms oh, nice. from the body. Yeah? Just do that. And secondly, the, the knees, don't have the knees locked like this. Yeah? Let the knees just, just play free. Yeah? Just free. Yeah? And not also like that. Yeah? The neck, the head should just follow a natural. More easy. Yeah, I try again. Right. So there's a kind of a spring and a double wave going through, but it's not like this. See? This is the knees locked here. And I'm just so that it's kind of holding it. Let the knees play. This, this, yeah? This, this, this. Versus holding. So as the arms move, <laughs> the knees are like free. Yeah, this is the point. Yeah, I try again. Ah. It should feel again really like, it should feel like relaxed and it's like the joints are open, but not this kind of stiffness and more lower. Yeah? Open low. Again, it's this and here. Yeah? Let's try that. Okay. You look, and the arms just open, and then just. Yeah? Just that. Right. Three levels. And the idea is that the arms. I'm really being driven effortlessly by the movement of the body. So when you're doing this one, it's not like, it's just really a, yeah, really easy. And the idea is not so much on stretching as an opening up and freeing the body and moving from the hip work, yeah? This one. This one's the same. This one's easier. Just the spine rotating and freeing up, yeah? This one's a bit more the shoulders bring up. But again, it's the idea that I'm not doing this, it's more you let the joints go and you just swing from swing the body from the hip, yeah? Either way. Okay, so the basic theme is inner controls outer and the joints are free. Which is a kind of a basic theme in Aikido we're looking at, yeah? Okay, stand up. The last thing is roll the hip. Right, with a partner, basically. Look, one thing is try, as you move in, try and don't feel that you end up jamming up for a moment there. Yeah, this is a very easy thing to do. Yeah? Don't move in and jam and then try and come out of that. That moment you're going to be stuck. Try and feel that, again, the joints are open at this one here, but not this. Yeah? So move in, but don't collide. This feeling. Yeah? So that the, the system stays open on the shoulders. Yeah? This, yeah? But not this. And then boom, coming out again. Yeah? I try again. Yeah? Try and do it in one movement. Don't be going and then starting the motion. Yeah? Try and feel again next sword. Don't initiate from the outside. Have the thing that you initiate from inside. Yeah? So again you move in one piece, not in two. Not one and then going, but like just move. Yeah? So the thing is that you just do it like this. Yeah? But not like and then trying to do it like that. Yeah? So move from the inside here, here, yeah? Here. So one piece, not two. Yeah? I try again. What's the point of doing this other stuff with this? Yeah? Okay, it's not that I'm doing the technique here, I'm doing it with my whole body. So it begins like this. It doesn't begin like this. And then everything else is left, yeah? Also the extension, you're like going, he's, he's got your attention completely trapped, in a sense, because it's like a strong grip, and like, 
So then everything goes here. But actually, boom, this feeling versus that feeling. Yeah? So open up the whole body boom, there, and respond with the whole body. This versus everything becomes... Yeah, and I get completely split because nothing's really happening here. It's all dead. Yeah? So open up. It's as if both hands are being held. It's the same feeling. And then move with the whole body. Yeah? So be whole instead of split. Yeah? Hi, try it. Now, the whole body is everything like this. Now, this situation here and this situation here is the same situation. But also the extension in the sword. If I have the thing in my hand like this, it's like scrambled. There's no extension. Yeah? If you have the feeling of like this, the sword is out here. You're overextended. Yeah? So this and this. Have the same kind of feeling. So don't cramp in, don't stretch out, boom. Yeah? This feeling of being here in the ground, yeah, with the hips. This, not there, and not this, yeah? This, this, this. Yeah? I try again. <laughs> Look, everyone's doing it. Really, everyone's doing it. This kind of, yeah, this kind of, again, tension thing. Yeah? But it's not like you do, or, or even, <laughs> it's just this. You just go, your whole body has to feel, yeah? Versus that, which actually is contraction. Yeah? I'm actually going, and then from here I'm trying to sort of do it. But actually you just have the feeling, because we're like, so you expand in the situation. Yeah? But you don't lock up. That's the first response. This and this are quite different. Yeah? Yeah? Then, around, I'm coming in, in evasion, but I'm not in blending. See? I'm just hopping around the attack. I'm trying to get away from it. Yeah? So this is evasion with Aikido. Yeah? Try and absorb it. So you're gonna, he's going to come in and you're going to have a feeling going hey! slowly. So like, go slower than his attack. I have a feeling that you absorb, but you're not thrown back and trying to escape. Hey! See? So he comes in. Yeah? So it's slow. He comes in. Hey! That's the feeling. So you're actually going slower than him. You like absorb and slow him down. Oh! <coughs> yeah? Hey! Yeah? I'm on the run. Yeah? Eat him up. Yeah? Hey! You got all the time you want. Yeah? You don't have to run away. Yeah? I try that. Go slow. Go slow. Sorry, my mistake. The attacker should stay strong. Yeah, the attacker should stay normal speed strong. Hey. Boom. That kind of attack, good. And then I'm going to like oh. absorb it. That kind of feeling. So the attack is strong. He doesn't need to go slower. Hey. Yeah, this is quite difficult, yeah? Oh. Yeah, so absorb and go slow. Yeah, I try again. Hey. 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 So therefore we blend, yeah? Okay? Oh! This, yeah? But not... Yeah. 
<laughs> yeah, and then we're both colliding with each other, straight away. <coughs> so off red light is like an open door. Then he comes through. Then he comes through. Yeah? So don't like that straight away, yeah? Hi, try again. <laughs> <laughs> There should be no warning. Yeah, hopefully. Yeah. So, I just, there, it's like, there's no warning here. It goes here, straight away. But if I do it like this, he knows that he has to sort of, he, he knows where to stop me straight away. <coughs> and then he comes in, yeah? There's nothing happening in the arm. You just turn, the arm follows from the center. So just this first part, yeah? If you get this, okay, it's really unstoppable, yeah? If you don't have it, straight away I walk into something. Yeah? This versus that. Yeah? So again, come into the body and work from here to the outside. Don't work on the outside of the body. Yeah? I just that. <laughs> this is so tricky. Look. The, the set of these, you're giving the arm, the dead arm, and then he just grabs it. So he's got it. Then what I do first of all is open up. Open up, connect, and free the joints. Yeah? At this situation here, he's got the elbow, he's got me locked up there. So, it's not that I do boom, this, yeah? It's again kind of it's like do this. And now the joints are free, yeah? Then I can do it. Yeah? Yeah? But it's not about opening up by going boom, this. That is adding tension, yeah? It's actually like this. It's very subtle. You just go boom, yeah? And then you're free to move, yeah? And then I'm already immediately outside because I'm like trying to force it here. But then of course there's no way. I'm just feeding his, his attack. He can just have his attack. Got it? <coughs> Fine. No problem. Just open. I'm not struggling with this. There's no boom <coughs> doing that. Yeah? So just douche. Yeah, it's quite subtle. Yeah? I tried that. <laughs> okay, you see you're opening up. Fine. Okay, now give yourself lots of space. And then you'll take hers. Yeah? I draw out really if I if I end up using force I contract, then she she'll contract too. Yeah? So what's happening is like, okay. And then I start to go here. So as I close in, she closes in. So we're like stuck, yeah? So keep the system open. Yeah. I've completely taken the center and there's no contraction going on, yeah? But the moment I close in, I start to fight with her. Yeah? There's no fighting. Yeah? Yes. She can just do that. Yeah. And will they come? Release. Okay, you should really be in a situation where you're with a sword. Yeah? Here. Okay, if you're in this place, or you're, uh, you're in this place, okay, you're, you're splitting up. You're splitting up. Yeah? So don't fight. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah. And you're not <coughs> in this place here. Yeah? Expanded. And then she's expanded as well. So you can lead her up. So don't crunch. Yeah? Yeah, I try it. What you do is, I want you to try and do this whole thing down one fluid thing. So there. So you don't, you don't, there's just enough, and then you come straight back. Look, this is like a kind of bit of a misunderstanding. Look, he's solid. Okay, I have this, and I go here and I stop. Okay, actually, this thing happens here. Okay, so we have this solid basic training. He does the first, and then he stops, and then what's happened? I move, and then I settle down again. So then he tries the second part. Yeah, it's like I'm like a rock, yeah? Okay? So it's like, in a sense, that's actually not what's happening, yeah? At the moment that he has a sense that he essentially moves forward the way he comes back. If he moves forward and settles again, yeah, mm -hmm. you can't throw him from there because it's just like a, a dead weight. So have the feeling that that's it. That's all it is, yeah? Don't confuse basic training with, with, a, with a combat application, like solid, <laughs> solid, and then... No one can throw anybody from this position. Actually, it's super easy to stop it. But that's not where you throw them. Yeah? It's like a... 
coming back. Yeah? So just this. It, it's like I just feel it's slightly drawn for, and that's enough for me to come back. Yeah? So now do it as a wave. Yeah? Don't stop at that position. Yeah? I try again. Sure, let's run. What we talked about this morning about training in the area where you can access things like hockey here and stuff. Yeah? If the grip is much too strong, yeah? Hey. Yeah? So, years and years pass by. Yeah. Hey. What I want to do is, I want to, this is called Kokyu Ho. So, what does that mean? So, with. Yeah? I'm, I'm looking for something a little bit different than, than that. Yeah? So, hey. Yeah, first of all, coming from the core. Okay? The moment that it's being drawn out, that I feel it's sitting out of the spine, okay? Now, now this is also core cube. Core cube, yeah? It's something to do with this spiral work in the body right from the ground. Core cube is not... <laughs> that, yeah? So, if you're going to work on core cube, you need to sort of like... Yeah? <coughs> And uh, one clue is this, the moment you use force, the joints lock up and, and it just becomes like boom, yeah? versus <laughs> everything is free, everything is moving from the hip, <laughs> versus <laughs> yeah? So try and stay away from that, if you want, yeah? Like try to get it. Come on! So work on, so in a sense it's basically this, they're just kind of square, and it's basically the hips, yeah, rooted in three lower joints, so the hips can actually move. Okay, and then the hips pass through a connected spine, really in a sense directly almost to the elbow. Yeah? And then it's like this. Yeah? This. So you're delivering, you're delivering in a spiral. Yeah? Now the key thing, did you ever see Sensei in, in a moment of boredom walking up and just playing with a column like this? You remember doing that? Never? I used to do that quite a lot. In winter there was nobody in the dojo. <laughs> so he would go up and he would just be kind of like, like this. Going, and he was just actually exercising this, this thing, like the hips were driving this. So this is actually kind of a variation, it's just basically the idea that this is motion, here, cock you, this is actually coming from the hips. Yeah? This, this, this. It's all basically the same idea. When you do sword, it's the same idea. This motion with the sword, this, 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 yeah? this. It's basically Taijutsu, it goes into Taijutsu. So we're all basically, based, everything is based on the first degree, really, really. This, 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 this. Yeah? We go from sword to Taijutsu in just very short steps. Yeah? That's basically the whole idea. So when you do Koki Ho, or, yeah? a bit different. Yeah? <laughs> okay? Okay, we're going to take a five minute break.